How to use Gumroad to collect emails. Hello new control channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Gumroad to collect emails. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And to create an account on Gumroad, you could also use my affiliate link below the description where earn a small commission at no additional cost to you. And by using the link, you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up. But before that, if you don't know what is Gumroad, it is an online digital marketplace designed for creators to sell products directly to their audience, in which the platform emerged from the need for a simple way to sell digital goods without the complexities of traditional e-commerce setups. And Gumroad allows users to sell a variety of products including ebooks, music software, and even physical items, making it a versatile choice for creators across different fields. So now to create an account, just click the link in the description or you could also click the login button and after signing in, you'll be able to be directed on this dashboard. And it will show you on the left side panel some of the options to start navigating. But to start collecting emails using Gumroad, creators can leverage the platform's built-in feature designed for email list building. Which is the first one is to simply set up our product or to create a digital product on Gumroad such as ebook or a free resource. Now in order to do that, can you click the products button on the left side panel. And from here it will show you a variety of products but to create a new one, just click new product button on the top right corner. And after that, the next thing that you need to do in here is to simply fill out the required information including the name of the product and choose here the products below which is ebook. And I'm going to enter the title of the ebook in here, Mi Amor ebook. And after that, below here you could also choose to enter the price. So you can simply enter here, zero. Or alternatively, you could also enter here the price, for example, $15. And click next customize button on the top right corner. And after that, from here, the next thing that you need to do under this product section is to simply fill out the other details including the description, the URL in here, and to upload a cover photo for your product that you're selling. And in creating a product cover or cover photo of ebook, we're going to use this platform, for example, canva.com, in which it is a versatile online graphic design tool that simplifies the creation of professional visual materials for users with varying levels of design experience. So from here, just simply go to the search bar after signing in and kindly search for the ebook templates. And after clicking on the enter or the search bar, you'll be able to see here some of the templates. That you can choose from that is offered for free. However, some of these templates are need to have a premium account in order to use one, but I'm going to choose this one and click the customize button in here to proceed. In which after doing so, you'll now be able to be directed on this page where you can start customizing this template in here. By simply clicking on it, you can start highlighting it and choosing or entering here the context or title of this ebook. And from here, I'm going to also customize the name of the author in here. So basically, you can simply customize this template depending on your preferences using some of the editing tools that you can find on the left side panel also, such as to choose the design elements, such as graphic design also, text, brand, and even uploads here a file from your computer. But if you're now done customizing this cover for your ebook, you simply proceed by clicking the share button on the top right corner. But before that, we're going to rename this one into our title in here of the ebook. And once again, to save the changes or to download this one, just click the share button on the top right corner and click download button in here. But you also need to make sure that the file type is now being selected as PNG or JPG as the file type before downloading it. And if you're now done, you can now proceed by going back to this page and click upload images and choose computer files. Then you simply select the files or the ebook cover that we just customize on your computer files in here and after choosing it it will automatically be uploaded on this page and all you need to do is wait for it to load now so you can see this is basically what it looks like and if we scroll down we could also fill out the required information including this call to action instead of i want this you can click or choose by this you could also enter here the summary or the description of this ebook but at this point, let's say I'm going to enter here, get this limited edition ebook. You'd also enter the additional details such as the pages or other detail integrations in here. And settings such as to limit the product sales if you want, allow customers to choose or publicly show the number of sales on your product page. Then click save and continue on the top right corner to proceed. 
since we're just trying to make here to collect the emails. Under this content, we can start filling out the required information including our uploaded ebook. So we can click in here upload files and click upload button to proceed. And again, just simply choose our ebook. And if you're now done adding or uploading the file, just click the publish and continue button to proceed. And upon clicking on it, you will not be able to be directed on this page and it will show you that the ebook is now being published successfully. And as you can see, we can start copying the URL in here to share, in which from here, when a user tries to download the product, they are required to enter their email address, which is Comroad complies for them. And after that, we'll be able to get their email address and start collecting it as our subscribers. And now aside from creating a products in here, we could also create here an automated email workflows in which it is featured in Gumroad to set up automated email sequences. So to do that, kind of click this workflows button on the left side panel. And from here it will show us that we can create a new one by clicking new workflow button on the top right corner. And by clicking on it, it will show us in here that we can start naming and also choosing here the workflow trigger. For example, I'm going to enter here the name buy. And after that, I'm going to choose the trigger option, which is purchase. And from here, we can check these boxes to also send to past customer. Then choose here any product, which is, for example, our ebook. And also choose paid more than the amount in here. And also purchase the after date and purchase before date in here. And I'm going to choose anywhere. And to save the changes, just click the save button on the top right corner. Now moving on, aside from that, under these emails, we can start creating an email in here, such as pending here the subject and also the content in here. We could also select here the number of bars after the purchase that will be sent and also attach a file in here. So basically, from here, we can start designing a series of emails that are sent out after the customer subscribes or purchases a product, in which this could include welcome messages additional resources or promotional offers related to our products. And if you're not done, you can now click the publish button or the save changes button on the top right corner. Now moving on the other way is to simply click this emails option and it will show us on the top panel the option which is subscribers. So kind of click on it in which utilizing the subscriber pages, it is automatically includes a subscriber page feature which allows visitors in your store to optimize or opt in to receive the updates and promotions making it easy to grow your email list organically so from here we can start clicking the share subscribe page on the top right corner in which by clicking on it you will be able to copy the link and paste it for example on this page and this is basically what the subscriber will see when they try to click the link in which they are required to enter their email address to subscribe and that's the other way on how we can start collecting the emails in gumroad so overall, that is just basically how you can use Gumroad to collect emails. Thank you.